Okay, class, before we start our uh, lesson for today, let us all stand for our prayer. Oh Lord, thank you for this wonderful day. Bless us, oh Lord. Please guide us to our lessons and just we pray. Amen. Good morning, class. Good morning, ma'am. Okay. Pwede na kayong maupo. Let me check your attendance first before we start. Elika, Vincent, Angela, present po ma'am. Okay, very good. Lahat kayo ay present. Okay, class. So, what was our lessons? Uh, what was our lesson yesterday? It's all about. Yes, Elika. It's all about living and non-living things, ma'am. Very good. It's all about the living things and non-living things. So, who can give me some examples of living things? Yes, Angela. Human po, ma'am. Very good. Very good. So, that's the example of living things. So, how about non-living things? You can give me some examples of non-living things. Okay. Vincent? Okay. Yes. Very good. What else? Yes. Very good. So, um, that's, that is uh, one of the examples of non-living things. So, very good. And now, class, meron akong papakita sa inyo ng mga pictures and I want you to Observe and uh, tingnan nyo ito na maigi. Because later on, mayroon akong ipapagawa sa inyo ng mga activities regarding with this. Hmm. Ah, mga hayop, dog, cat. Okay, ma'am. Okay. So, okay, class. What did you see in the pictures? Yes, very good. There are animals. So, where does, uh, where does animals live? The dog. Where is dog living? Ma'am. Um, in the land, ma'am. In the land po. And, very good. How about the fish? Where does fish living? Ma'am, in the water po. Yes, very good. The fish is living in the water or in the sea. Very good. So, how about the bird? How about the bird class? Saan natin makikita ang bird? Yes, very good. Makikita natin ang bird sa sky. So, ang ang bird is isang uri ng hayop na lumilipad. So, we can see bird. Um, minsan, makikita natin sila sa uh, trees and in the sky. So, very good. At ngayon, class, um, let us discuss all about the habitat of animals. So, Ano nga ba yung habitat ng animals, ma'am? So, ang habitat ng animals is depending on the animals. So, like for example, um, the cow. Hindi pwedeng ang cow ay maninirahan sa dagat. Dahil ang cow ay hindi marunong, oh, yes, very good. Hindi gagaya ng fish na ang kanilang tirahan talaga ay sa dagat. So, ang ang cow, saan sila nakatira? Sa land. So, ang habitat ng cow is on the land. And, how about the fish? So, ang fish, hindi siya pwedeng sa land kasi hindi siya mabubuhay sa land. So, ang fish is ma mabubuhay lamang sa dagat or sa water. And then, the how the bird is also we can see the bird in the sky 
hindi siya pwede mamalagi sa land and also in water. Dahil ang kanilang ang kanilang characteristic is not like the cow and the fish. So the bird is a flying animal and the fish is belong to the habitat of water and the cow is the land. Meron din tayong mga um, animals that are um, similar like for example frog. Pwede natin siya makita sa land at the same time in water. Um, crocodile. You can see crocodile in water at the same time at the same time in land. Okay, class. So, here are some examples of animals that can live both land and water. This. Uh, yan pala yung mga sample ng both land and water na animals. Okay, ma'am. The bullfrog or frog and salamanders so they are both uh, living in land and water and now class i want you to go to your apps in your um cell phones and answer the questions that i posted there i will give you uh, 10 minutes to do the activity Oh, I said I need me, huh? Mm. Okay, class, are you done? Okay, very good. So, the next is you will answer the quiz that I've gi given, um, that I've posted it also in your app. So, you will answer. So, what are you going to do? You will answer the questions. Write the letter F if the animals, um, lives on land while uh, write W if the animals lives on water. So, I posted there also the direction on how are you going to answer the questions. Okay? I will give you 10 minutes to do the quiz. Okay? No? So, for your assignment, research the meaning of photosynthesis. So, that's all for today. Goodbye, class. Goodbye and thank you, ma'am. Goodbye and thank you, ma'am. Thank you.